All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. Today is Wednesday. We are playing our Mecha Fan Bees combined with the Speedroids because, you know, there's actually uh, synergy and it's actually working out pretty well. Pretty well, I must say. And uh, are you looking at the uh, at what episode this is? This is episode 990, people. Let the countdown begin. We are running out of time, people. We don't we don't have much time left in this series. The series is pretty much over. Like, all right. Uh, you know, we got... This episode after that, two more weeks. Uh, I, I made a decision about what I'm gonna do for Daily Dose finale. Uh, what I decided is that we are going to do a big live stream. A big live stream. Uh, I still need to contact all the people who are gonna be available that Wednesday. It's gonna be on Wednesday, it's gonna be that Wednesday, actually, that day. Uh, to see if there's any of the tag partners or stuff that can join me because, of course, they're a huge part of Daily Dose. I would love if they could join me. Uh, we could. You know chat it up but this live stream you already know that my my live streams are two hours two hours i go from uh 10 a.m pacific to 12 p.m pacific no 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 this is daily duels the big finale <laughs> double it people double it all right we're going from 8 a.m to 12 p.m i'm gonna take that four hour live stream i'm gonna upload it and that's gonna be the daily duels finale and we've gone through so much and uh i mean a thousand a thousand that's crazy my dog but uh, thank you guys for all the support. Thank you guys for, you know, tuning in, watching. We've done this series for over three years now. It's crazy, but yeah. Uh, this is going to be difficult to deal with because during him play's turn, he can set my ass fucking down. So, uh, I mean, I got some from the extra deck, but like I said, he can just set my bitch ass down. So I'm kind of trying to figure out what I could really do here. Does this target? Yes, it does. It does target so I can normal summon this special summon special summon this then get my Duke and then sink into uh, clearing or fast do I have fast in here should I better have fast in here should have fast in here I hope so but that fast no I don't I'm too busy playing my own thing it's probably fast fast would be pretty good right now as well but the fact that I can go into clear wing and he's probably like, what? You know, what's up? So that's, that's good. That's good. The only problem is that I got that. It's nice that I got that speed recovery. That's cool and all, but I don't have, you know, right like this. If I can go into crystal meth right now, crystal meth would be way better than, you know, uh, clearing right now. But I don't have it. <laughs> I don't have it. I don't have it. Definitely don't have it. I can, I can get it next turn. I can go speed recovery, summon back my Takatom board, Takatom board, tribute yourself off, then get nail the red eye dice and do that play but for now I, I sit like this and hopefully you know he can't fuck me up because i'll kill him and then i have the solemn warning so oh, if i can stop anything else that he summons to threaten my clearing and then i'll be able to bust out crystal myth next turn problem is he's probably gonna get that double effect because he could i can summon crystal myth and he could bait me and then i kill him and then he's you know he'll still get his graveyard effect face up card no sure Oh, you're actually gonna do that? Oh, you're gonna sit yourself down! Alright, turn on targets using targets. This card is sensitive graveyard, but this card is place up. You can send one. Ooh, that doesn't target. If this face up card in its owner's control, a sensitive graveyard are banished by opponent's card effect. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. So he's gonna flip himself face down, flip up, and then I can strike that. Yeah, that's fine. And you only get one flip summon per turn, so it's not like you can do it again, right? At least I hope there's. I hope you can't do it again. Oh, never mind. That's strike. I thought that was winning. Nope, that was strike. So then he can come back. Like Nosferatu is a sob. He don't fuck around. So can you flip him back? Can you flip him again? No, because he was special summon this turn, so he can't change his battle position. All right, but you still have four cards in your hand. You can still easily do something and fuck me up. You know, if I can, if I can last, then. Next turn, I can make a crystal math, and crystal math can handle the the dragons. Oh yes, yes, he didn't have anything else. Yeah, another turn. Thank you, strike. Oh, and then try another strike. Let's go, boys. All right, and so I can spear monster my graveyard. I got a talk a tom board. Talk a tom board. Trip it yourself off. Summon uh, red eyed dice and crystal math. We already know that is some good drugs. <sighs> ah, crystal math. Do you snort? Crystal I don't, I, no, I don't think so. I think you smoke it. I think you smoke. I don't know how to do fucking drugs. I don't do drugs. <laughs> God, the fuck is wrong with me? So, uh, so I can attack it. And this card. 
Is that face up card? No. This card flipped up face up. You can tell one card. Okay. But then, would I kill it with my effect? Or, uh, 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 I guess I'll find out. Hopefully he doesn't just keep on fucking sending itself. Like, that would, that would be annoying. So he's gonna go off. I can negate that. Because obviously he'll send me. Now, do you just get to come right back? Because that's the case. Then fuck me! Oh my god. Alright, no, Suratu. You, you are a S-O fucking B. So you just pretty much get to come back every single turn. Because I'm gonna keep on killing you. But you're just gonna be like, surprise, 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 surprise. Every single turn. Wow. So I pretty much need to kill him twice? No, because it doesn't say you can only use the effect of Nosferatu once per turn. Like, oh my god, Nosferatu is a fucking great-ass fucking rank, rank 6. Like, holy shit. So I'm gonna get and kill him, and then he'll just set himself again. Like, how am I supposed to kill this fucker? Like, I literally have to... How do I kill him? Like, legitimately, how do I deal with this? Like, I, I guess I could attack and then strike his effect in the graveyard. I'm gonna have to do that. I'm gonna have to attack and strike his effect in the graveyard. Or you could just trigger him off. Okay. Okay. The opponent control one blah 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 blah. And this card is stupid, so make the target one blah, 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 blah. That's fine. So I guess you're gonna try to make a uh, rank six out threaten me, like M7, I guess. I'm just glad you actually legitimately got rid of that Nosferatu. He, he was driving me crazy. I can go with that M7. Or yeah, or beyond. Or beyond. That works. Sorry, I have another strike. I drew it. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I scoop, I scoop. Like, strike. Stupid at multiples. It really is. It's totally not fair that I get to stop any inherent summon or any monster for Kratin, but hey, Konami wanted to make their money. It's all about money in Yu-Gi-Oh, right? And we're gonna do a bear back. Alright, another duel. Ah, oh, thank you for actually getting rid of that Nosferatu for me. That's shit, Nosferatu, you're so good. You do not fuck around. Okay, well, this opening hand's actually pretty good. Yeah, I could special summon this. This can summon red eye dice, do whatever. Then I could, yeah, I could increase the level, make a clearing. Then I could summon back, summon double yo yo, double yo yo, summon uh, the red eye dice again, and bam, there's crystal math, like shit. Uh, didn't open up with any mecha phantom beast for the mecha phantom beast deck. I apologize, you already know. So, well, I, I got it with Taka Tomboy, because I can't conduct my normal summon. So, Taka Tomboy, Taka Tomboy, red eye dice, because I just get red eye dice, that'll be my normal summon. So, it's gotta be Taka Tomboy. You already know. So, uh, if you guys can make it to that live stream, I say it'll be November 2nd. I'll be doing from 8 a.m. Pacific time to 12 p.m. Uh, four hour live stream. Uh, what we're going to be doing is similar to the I'm in Y live stream where we just play with you about it. We're going to be playing with the five decks that are currently on. Like I said, these decks will be going towards the end because they're friend. Just because the finale data duels doesn't mean that, you know, other decks get to, you know, come back and, you know, pop into the limelight and all that. Like, that's, that's not even necessary. Uh, you know, it'll be these decks. These decks are the decks that are currently on daily rules. The final lineup, you know, when we did the polls. So it'll be these decks, of course, that include the deck profiles for us, uh, those decks. And, uh, yeah, it'll just be a big celebration of daily duels. And then that'll be it. I said I'm actually going to take a break. I'm actually going to take a break from YouTube. Because it has been a cool minute. It's pretty much been like a year since I took a break. You know, we have occasional occasional days of nothing, you know, or, you know, no live stream, I'm busy, I'm out of town, or that day, you know, I've been keeping strong for pretty much a year now, because I remember I took, last year I took a break, and around, I think I came back in November, so, you know, uh, I'll be taking uh, November off. I would like to set all of these, but I'm afraid, you know what, it's just best to set, I was thinking about just setting one, but in this case, it's best to set all. Let me go ahead and bust out that crystal mess. How do you answer crystal mess? Ha, you throw a dark color yaki at it, right? I mean, you know, I don't have, uh, I didn't summon it with the wind witches, so you could just throw a dark color yaki at it. Ha, how did I know? No, fuck you. How did I know? Too easy. Too easy. That, that was obvious. Like, like, I, I, I think crystal mess is one of the main cards that hits with for yaki. Like, I swear to Christ it does. <laughs> you look, you 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 summon the ultimate of the mind, you summon it properly, you suck yaki, but hey with some witch witches you can't do that. Like that's too easy of an out. Now crystal math plus chasing wings, like I really do like chasing wings. Like for a synchro card, it's just mwah, like oh, pff, this card's so good. It's like okay, okay, sure. <laughs> uh Dude, if I flip up the vanities, he's pretty much done. Like, I'm legitimately wondering what he's gonna do. 
Because he's obviously going to summon Lone Fire and tribute off, but then I can just fucking negate that shit, which I probably will, because I don't want him to go through his deck and shit like that. Like, nah, get that shit out of here, negate. No, 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 not today. <laughs> okay. Battle step? Don't you have to... That's weird that you just enter battle phase and you can just summon it. Like, battle step. That's weird. I thought battle step is when we're battling. We're not battling. You're just in a battle phase. You have nothing to battle with. I guess. Like, you're just gonna do it like that? Ah, ah, you're trying to instant feature Norton. No, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna vanity that. GG. GG pretty much, pretty much. Like, no, no. <laughs> I see what you were trying to do with I, I no. <laughs> Oh, well, I got my tether whip, but I won't get a token because they're in exemptiness. So I think, you know, like, now I'm just going to hold off. Like, I see what you're going to do. You're going to, like, you know, institution for Norton and all that. But get that enabling shit out of my face. Fuck you, Norton. <sighs> anyway, despite the, you know, wrapping up, about to take a break, I have a lot of shit on my plate. Like, I've been super busy lately. Like, Outside of just, you know, recording for you guys, I'm in my final week of the current course, which I hate, I hate. Like, I, I talked about the professor's back, and what I was worried about legitimately happened, you know? Uh, like I said, she hasn't done shit pretty much the entire semester. She just came back at, you know, the end of week three, and now she's trying to do shit. So, each week we have assignments. Week, week, I did week one's assignment. Oh, oh, definitely that MST, though. Definitely an MST pop my chasing wings and then that, there goes my vanities, right? Yeah, 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 I see you. I see you, my dog. I see you. Yep, go ahead. Yep, MST my chasing wings and there goes my vanities. Tears. At least you can't special summon this turn. Alright, go ahead and set a monster. That's fine. I'm gonna get that damage. They call me damage, so I guess I'll just go ahead and summon Tether Wolf and Tether Wolf will give me a token. That's not terrible. <laughs> And fuck it. Fuck it, I can actually play now. He already plays with Geki, so. So I really, what, what is he playing? I don't even remember what he's playing. Like plants or something like that? Tyler left a 17. Yeah, if your booty's so strong, then I can't get over it, so. Oh, well. Ugh, that's tough, because this card could actually fuck me up. You know what, I, I think that, I think another Jurangato is fine. You can have that, Danny, but I'm mad at. Yeah, so you can kill the Dragon Gate this time. Unkill that. No, I don't want the boost. <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. And then Crystal Matthew, you take this, take out whatever this is. And if it's a foot monster, then I'll be like, hell no, to the no, no, no. Oh. I forgot that, or I may just got another card. Like, legitimately. Okay. Okay, yeah, they yeah, got like a tuner monster and they got a sinker monster. Kind of, kind of forgot about that because it came and went real quick, real quick. But hey, what you gonna do? So uh, GG, pretty much. I mean, okay. Uh, I said I could take the swift neck with the tune twister, but I think I'm okay right now. Ooh, transmodify. I could turn something into something. <laughs> I could turn something into something. I think for now I'm just gonna go ahead and turn the crystal meta to defense mode and then summon Duke and then Duke tribute off and you know, cause I'll, I'll win eventually. I'm in no hurry to win, especially if you set one more card. I got the twin twister. I'm gonna hold on to transmodify. Now I'm just gonna sink into, uh, what's it called? What's it called? If this is torrential tribute, then fuck me. Divanity's emptiness. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and take this to 27. So that really doesn't change much whether I'm attacking it. Uh, I mean, it was a card at one. I'm just glad I wasn't a TT because I would have lost this, I would have lost this, I would have lost a token, that would have sucked. <laughs> but I'm in no hurry to win. No hurry at all. But yeah, I've been super busy. Like, school is so stupid. So she graded my week one assignment and she's like, she took off points. Uh, it was worth 20 points. She gave me a 17 because she's like, oh, you didn't do this assignment completely properly and all that. But and she didn't like my formatting, I did the same formatting for assignments two and three because I didn't know if I did anything wrong because I didn't get any feedback until fucking the end of week three. So she's probably gonna end up taking points off of my assignments for week two and week three, and it's just like, fuck me, you know? And her grading curve is 
hard, man, hard. Like, and, and in regular class, you know, A minus is like what, 93, 92%, right? A minus in her class, 95%. Like, fuck me, you know? So, uh, I probably, and yes, it does count. All right, there's a difference in my in, in my college. There is a difference between a four, you know, an A and A minus. I think I'll get a 4.0, and I think an A minus is like 3.7. So my GPA will drop if I get an A minus. It's just like, okay, fuck me, you know. So because of her bitch ass and not giving me feedback, I really can't make corrections. Simon's already turned in, so I'm gonna get take points taken off for the same exact thing. And she'll probably even fucking rag me on this. She's like, well, uh, I think I uh, you know corrected you on these mistakes. Like you didn't grade until the end of week three. How was I supposed to know you didn't give me any uh, direct feedback? I already rated her as a professor. I gave her a fucking one out of five stars. Like terrible, the worst, the worst professor that I've had in this fucking in this fucking college. I swear to Christ, I swear to Christ. Okay, so you're dead, and then this is gone. Cool. Yeah, like holy shit, holy holy bubbly doody doody. Like I, I do not enjoy her as a professor at all. So we can go ahead and turn her summon into what seems to be one of the best monsters in this deck that start as charge warrior, draw a card. Cause you already know that that's great. Oh, there's another chasing wounds, and then I could actually use Duke and summon me back my red eye dice. But is there really anything I want to do? I can go to Armades. I can go into. I can go into another seven, which I guess would be the Mecha Phantom Beast thing. Not to myself, put in fucking, uh, um, what's it called? Put it in fast. Like, fast is good. Like, that's what I could legitimately good. Okay, I was about to say, like, that, that does nothing. <laughs> like, you summon that, and it's like, okay, I guess. <laughs> Cactus Bouncer. All right. Oh, I guess we'll get another duel. Bear back. All right, another duel. So yeah, uh, I need to do our observation still. Uh, I like I said, I contacted her. She set it up with the school on Monday. Called the school. They're like, oh yeah, yeah, we'll totally, you know, uh, uh, get that started and all of that. I don't know why. One second, my stack goes first. Like this is definitely more of a first hand. Uh, especially since he'll be able to set up back row and stop my crystal method going to it. Yeah, definitely should have went first. Definitely. Oh, definitely. Definitely should have went first. Oh, shit. It's blue eyes. <laughs> oh, shit. What up? So, special summon this. Yes. Uh, I could go into a crystal mask. I don't think I'll pull it off, but I could. So, I can talk a tom board, talk a tom board, uh, red eye dice, red eye dice, increase this to, I guess it'd be four. Normal summon this. Then sink seven, sink eight. So I could bust out a crystal man, but I can't guarantee that anything's gonna go through with you know this. <laughs> or yeah, or that, or that. That works. I guess I'll just summon Duke. Yeah. Strike is still. Remember, people, strike is still at multiples. Uh, I, you know, I could foolish and send. I could trish this man, can I? I could trish this man. Because if I foolish and I send my Mecha Phantom Beast, then in Graveyard I get a token. And that's a trick and that's a Trish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't think I'm stuck with win, because I didn't even use my Taka Tomborg effect. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? You know what? Fuck it. I mean if he has another strike, I mean he has another strike, right? So I believe when this card is sent to the graveyard, if this card is sent to graveyard, I can special summon a Mecha Phantom Beast token when that's level three, yeah. And then just show normal something would be nice if it ever comes up in this duel, but definitely should have went first. Definitely should have went first. I mean, I opened up the warning, opened up the chasing wings, like, definitely should have went first. I mean, I still got another Terra Top, so that's great, but boy, you about to get Trish, you lud. Unless you have another strike, which if you do, then <laughs> why not open up a multiple strikes, right? Trisha effect? Am I gonna get it all? Am I gonna get? Yeah, get that fucking maiden out of my fucking face. That doesn't target. Get that strike out of here. Get that card out of your hand out of here, boy. Gone. Gone, my dog. Oh, that blue eyes is gone. Whoo! You're like, shit, I'm gonna strike that fucking Taka Tom board, like, nigga. Okay, I guess. <laughs> Instead of at least waited for me to actually use my effect, you didn't even let me use my effect. You could have struck the effect and then. Right? I'm tripping some of this card, special one. I'll see for the rest of the turn you get on. So does the monster have to fit the field or am I effect negate it? Because I attempted to use the effect, but I don't think that matters. Like, 
Uh, I would love to set two, but I think I'm just going to set one because of Chasing Wings. Because he might have a Twin Twister set. And no my luck, he'll probably draw into an Ancient White Stone and then want a Twin Twister and pop both my cards and do an Ancient White Stone play, so fuck that, you know. <sighs> I already know how stupid Ancient White Stone is in Blue Eyes. Like, like, oh, what? Oh, okay. Well, it was the play I thought. It just wasn't Ancient White Stone. It was just, it was just regular Blue Eyes. But still, the, the fact still remains. I thought he was going to have the Twin Twister. So he, I said, I don't set two anymore. I never set two. Never. I either set fucking... I either set one or multiples, but never two, because I'm just asking for it. I'm just asking to be blown back by the Twin Twister, so. Ah, Trishula coming through. King of the Nines. Get out of here, Vermillion. No one gives a shit about you. Dog. The only way the Vermillion is ever relevant is if I'm using one tuner and one or more non tuner monsters to sink into a nine. But if I'm doing fucking two non tuners, <laughs> Trish all day, my dog. Trish all day. Ah, <laughs> get blown back. This man's getting destroyed. Woo, be blue eyes. I kind of feel like one more duel. Yeah, one more duel. Be right back. All right. So, the observation, I call on Monday. They said, oh, yeah, well, we're going to talk to the principal. Set that up. Didn't get a phone call back. Tuesday, called. I was like, oh, they're like, oh yeah, we'll, we'll talk to the teacher. You can set up with that. All right, I'm waiting for the phone call. No call back. I right, said, so I'm recording this today. I had Wednesday. I have, the observation has to be done by Friday, damn it. Like, you can't be fucking around. The last thing I need for the fucking, from the press, I'd be like, you didn't do the observation while I set it up? They never contacted me and, you know, did anything with it. So, it's, it's just really frustrating. It really is. It's like, I, I legitimately want to just get this done. I get this over with, but they just keep fucking around with me. So, hopefully, hopefully I can get her done, get the observation done and all that. Oh, this is, this is just straight up cancer.dac. All right, well, this will be fun. This will be fun. Go ahead and get that around me. I already know. Summon her so you don't have to pay anything for all your counter traps you love to play. I already know. I already know. Oh, this will be fun. So, I don't think I should play anything. I don't think I should activate anything. I don't think I should fucking touch anything. Like, <coughs> drastic drop off. Damn. All right. So, I mean, we even out, but still. <laughs> like, all right. So. Oh, that's a mandatory effect. Oh, shit. I think I'm gonna summon Mega Raptor. Yeah, just normal summon Mega Raptor. And I'll poke. Like, there, there's no reason to activate any effects. He might have strike, he might have run, he might have Divine Wrath. Like, there's no reason to activate anything. I just gotta take it slow. You know? Because I could have special summon the Taka Tom Morgan and done all that. If you would have let me get it off, I could have went into like an Armadius with uh, Red Eye Dice or the Duke. Ooh, there's a negate attack, ultimate providence, ultimate providence. All right. So, what's in your... Oh, wait, you don't have to pay the cost. You can just pretty much negate everything. High and cardinalize! Woo! Of course he dread. Oh, shit. <laughs> <coughs> oh, this duel's gonna be very difficult. Very, 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 very difficult. So, wonderful, Ronimus, I know you have an ultimate providence. Pitch every... Wow, wow, you drink so fucking... You drink some shit, boy. Another drastic drop off. I'm gonna strike that. Oh, I can't strike that. Because I guess it activates in the same chain. Yeah. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Immediately. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. I really would love to strike fucking Bount uh, Bountiful Arnimus. Definitely. Ugh. Is that once per turn? No, it's just every time. Every time. Fuck. Fuck. I just gotta attack. If he has a negate attack, then rip me, I guess. Yeah, I need to get I need to get Artemis off the fucking field. I can't I can't have him drawing every turn. He has a negate attack, block attack, draw a card, but I know he has ultimate providence, so I'm not doing anything. It's a quaking, of course it's a quaking. Shit. 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 Ah. <laughs> uh. I wish I could normal summon this without summoning the token, but the summoning the token is mandatory. So, he can just negate me and then kill me, you know? If he's straight out of the province, I'm dead, and then he'll draw a card, so... That's a problem. And of course there's a fucking quaking, like, fucking... Ah, uh, fuck me. This duel is gonna be very fucking difficult, because... If I summon this, he's dead. Uh, it's gonna die, like, it's obviously gonna die. It's gonna activate, and he's clearly gonna just go, Ultimate Providence, pop, draw a card, so... So it's better to just take it now, take the L now. I guess it's just better to take the L now. No, no, it's not. Like, 
Fuck me. Why? Why? Why did it have to be quaking? Of all the mirror forces, it just had to be fucking quaking. I need to kill that Artemis. Like, I hope there's a rotten name. So if she's destroyed, then she gets to go ahead and reveal and get more counter traps, get more fucking straight up cancer. Like, ah, Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, that's the nice thing about Yu-Gi-Oh is that there's so much freedom that you can do a lot of things. But then that, it just leads to a whole bunch of cancer. Like, it really does. Like, cards just have interactions and it just leads to just to death and destruction of this game. You know, so. I wish you didn't activate. I wish you didn't. But you do, so. Ultimate Providence. Yep. I wish you didn't, but you do, so fuck me. Like, I, I, I have nothing. I have nothing. Nope. Wow, you drop that, and you can go ahead and summon that. So, I guess I'll go ahead and strike that. I can't have him summoning on my fucking bitch ass. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then he gets it for my strike, too. Oh! Alright, I scoop. I scoop. <laughs> I scoop. Like, oh my god. I might have been okay if he didn't have that quaking. Because I could have attacked over the, the arm. It's like, I was trying to be cautious, but that quaking fucked me. That quaking fucked me real hard. And I just started playing into his game. That sucks. That sucks. Ugh. Anyway, I need to get the field observation done. Uh, recording for you guys. Um, and then also, they decided to allow me to be a tester for Dragon Ball Z League again. They, like, literally, I've been... Since I was a tester back in, like, Season 6, and now we're going into 8, uh, I stopped being a tester because there wasn't much going on, so I resigned, you know. And I was getting kind of sick of it. So then I was like, can I come back? And they're like, no. Can I come back? No. I think I asked, like, maybe, like, four or five times and they just said no but then they're like oh we're desperately looking for testers i was the only one who applied and they you know had a discussion uh the one guy the one of the admins in the league that hates me of course said no but he got overruled so now i'm a tester now so i'm doing test videos for Ball Z. you might you might remember those when i i uploaded a couple to my channel but temporarily before you know they gave me access to the actual youtube channel you guys already know i'm into dragon ball z but you guys uh, when this series season's actually going on, I'll temporarily upload a video saying that's going on. So if you guys want to watch it, it's there. But uh, right now we're on break. We don't start up until next year. You know, once uh, season per year. That's how it goes. Just like a regular sports league, which is fine. Uh, so I'm testing out. So doing that, just you know, I'm super busy. I'm super busy. So on top of you know recording and doing all this content for you guys, I'm doing a lot of other things. So. Hope you guys appreciate it. So, that's it. if you guys can join me that Wednesday, November the second, we're going to be live streaming for four hours to you know celebrate the grand finale of uh, Daily Duels, wrapping it up. Then I'm taking a break. Uh, probably be like probably one month because I, I want to come back and uh, I mean when I'm taking a break, it's not going to be like you know I'm not doing anything. I'll still be busy behind the scenes, you know, uh, you know tweaking the channel, getting ready for the changes, uh, preparing League Season Two, which I want to start in January. So it's still going to be busy behind the scenes, but. To not have to, you know, record daily will be nice, and uh, and then when the Shamshir has come, that'll be nice too. Like I, I love daily duels and all that, but the daily part of daily duels can get a little draining. You know, it's like I pretty much play Yu-Gi-Oh, record Yu-Gi-Oh every day, and then I do a little buy more while I'm streaming. It's just you know, kind of draining. So with the channel changes, I won't have to. I won't have to play Yu-Gi-Oh every day. You know, we'll be doing the live streams like Saturday and Sunday. So that's when you know, outside of that, I really don't have to touch, touch, play, play Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh. So, you know, I'll be more inclined and excited to actually do the live streams instead of just, well, I'm drained from Daily Duels. All right, well, it's Saturday. Time to record more Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> so, yeah, I think the channel changes will be for the best. You know, you'll still be getting an upload from me, from, from what uh, the changes are looking like right now. Uh, you'll still be getting an upload from me each and every single day, Monday through Friday. Uh, there won't be any uploads on Saturday and Sunday, but the live streams on Saturday and Sunday. So pretty much you're going to be doing something you get every day. And, you know, I think that the perfect number is one upload per day from uh you know it, it's just the right amount to stay relevant but i'm not spamming you guys because i already know I'm, right now i'm definitely spamming you guys i give you guys like what 11 uploads 11 uploads 10 really weak days in the line of live stream so 11 uploads uh so plenty plenty of content so uh that will be cut down but it's fine then of course league no will increase uploads you'll be getting that during the weekends as well but uh now, League is totally separate. That's a totally separate entire beast. So I gotta work on League. Hopefully, get it, um, guess uploaded. You know, get it, get it. I'll leave enough time for more uh, networking. I didn't leave enough time for networking when I wanted to start season two. So I guess it was kind of a miracle that um, that DN went down and we had to postpone it because we'd be doing League right now and that would be on top of all the things I'm doing. So it'd be super draining. But uh, for right now, you know. Uh, when the champion's coming, I'm not. I don't have to play Yu-Gi-Oh every day. It would make. They would make League a 
ton easier. It really would. So, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this uh, episode of Daily Duels. Like I said, let the countdown begin. We got nine more episodes. Nine more episodes, no? Nine more episodes. So, uh, wow. I, I can't believe that we're actually going to make it to 1,000 Daily Duels. It's crazy. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I will see you guys tomorrow. Tagging, playing with Gaia. I need to tweak that deck a little bit. Make it a little bit more consistent. Add more dragons. Because that deck is... It's, it's a one-trick one pony. But, hey, what are we going to do, right? So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow.